And we're back. Welcome. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I did take and go back to the Arcjet building and got all that resource, those precious weapons, and all the other goodies that the game forced me to leave behind. Speaking of which, I probably should. Come here, dog. Hey. I've got to un I've got to take things out of your ass. Hold on. <laughs> uh, you've got so much. Uh, I'll just take everything. Yeah, but time was equipped. I don't know why, and I messed this up by... Oh, you know what? Did I get a bunch of stuff? So I may have enough to clean this up a bit. I would like to take and cut the rust off of it. All right, so I have no junk. But I'm going to leave a lot of the weapons and everything else in this because fundamentally they are useless for the moment unless I break it down. I mean, you can break them all down. But I don't want to do that. I want to keep them or at least get like the maximum use out of them when I get a... Oh, when I get the rest of my upgrades done. Get all that crap out, out, out. Don't need any of that. Don't need any of this. Don't need any of this crap. I am more awake this time, so I should, I should have better commentary. <laughs> I don't think I'll be tickled as pink as I once was when I was on this last time. So, be ready for some more seriousness and less silliness, right? The S and S situations. Uh, Razor, see, I should be able to use those in the little cell settlement up north here. I don't think I have to worry about any of this. I don't really have to worry about any of this stuff. I should have zero junk. Yep, I have zero junk and all that. Okay, great. And I'll probably get in my suit and walk it over here. We're going to do a little bit more for the Brotherhood. Because I, I feel like we can get away with more with them. Actually. So I was thinking about originally getting in the suit, jumping down here, and then just going back to Diamond City. But I think... We might be safe going here. We'll see. I gotta level up. My bad. I forgot that I could level up. Probably should. Let's see. Which ones do I need? Uh, I should take that just for my fusion cores. And I know I want to. I also want science because I'm going to be using a lot of laser technology because the lasers go out and they touch people. The regular munitions that require lead and whatnot are, what was it, uh, ballistics? Ballistics aren't as good as laser and plasma technology. It's all the rush, all the rush without the hassle. Don't need to worry about addiction. Could get tough. You know what? I'd probably get toughness. Maybe. Maybe. 50-50 split. Because then you do get 50% longer and then it's like doubles. Yeah, I probably will do that. Probably. Let's see. Ah, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. oh, there's just so many good things that I'm trying to think about that gives the best perks. Because just getting science. Let's see. Hold on. Let me check my bench here. What do I need here? See, if you want something like. Yeah, you need, like, level 1 gives me the gamma. Yeah, see? And then it's like, all I need is adhesives for that shit. And you'd have better. The thing is, I did up the boost. Or the bag, so I've got it boosted. The rest of these. Is this at all requires just 1? 1, 2, level 2, level 1? You know what? I think I'm going to stick with... It's going to be split between toughness... See, see the toughness or this. A nuclear physicist I could probably do later if I'm not going to use my suit right off the bat. And honestly, you know what? Hmm. Hmm. You know what? Screw it. I'll take the physicist. We'll use the suit. We'll use the suit just to show it off a little bit more. We don't uh, don't tend to use it all too much. We shouldn't have any issues either. I don't think we're going to have to go into a into hacking or anything like that. Now, I'm still not wielding the minigun. 
We won. Oh, I, I've just got my fists. Never mind. I've just got my fists. There we go. We got two power cores, so always remember to take and use this stuff sparingly. Especially early on. That's why I always tend to tend to go out by myself rather than just use it. But since we've got a lot of activity, I might as well. Might as well act like I'm a Brotherhood member. I've got a suit of power armor. Look at me! I'm cool! Alright, come on. Hey, see, so they have a security bot. I like how they... I gotta take and check that out. I didn't remember whether or not they took and changed the security bot up so much. Because the security bots used to be really, really mean. If you didn't have the right weapons for those security bots, they would tear you a new one. And in this, I'm guessing they really did tear us a new one. And as I said before, this is actually pretty nice. This is a pretty nice setup. They shouldn't have used... See, they always have this, like, the Brotherhood stuff looks rusted and shit. They, shouldn't that all look, like, brand spanking new? And do they not smelt that stuff themselves and make it? Ooh, and there's also a workbench. Oh, so we can probably use this as a mini outpost as well. Really wish we could break it apart. So this is what ours needs. This, this is what we need right here. You just have a little thing to close up, open back up. That's what we need. It's that kind of safety and security that I want in my own gas stop that I don't have. Speaking of which, is there more stuff to take? Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. And see, I think they picked up the bodies up here as well. So if you've already... Obviously, we don't have any of the ghoul bodies over here anymore. And there's nobody on guard, so somebody's clowning around. Somebody's not doing their job. So you'd at least want maybe one or two guys here, somebody across here. Even if you had just a small team, you'd want somebody standing guard. At least look out. And you wouldn't even know if I came into the building. Now let's see what the Brotherhood has to say to us today. They're probably going to go bing bing bong bong bing. Yes. Bing 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 bong. See you alive and well, sir. Are we in luck? Sir, mission accomplished. We have the transmitter. Finally, some good news for a change. Nice work, sir. I didn't do it alone. Hey, hey Dance. You see, <laughs> you're back. Oh, Alan. Reese, Hello. It's time to welcome our newest recruit to the recon team. He shows a lot of promise, and with the proper guidance, I think he has the potential of becoming one of the best. Cough, cough. Joke. I'm only in it for the spiffy uniforms. Oh yeah? And here I thought you joined up for a sense of purpose and meaning. Oh god. You decided to stay, huh? I expected you to take your payment and run. Oh god. Let's just hug this out and get it over with. What do you say? You can play it however you want, tough guy. It's gonna take a lot more than completing oh! mission to me. Reese, that's enough. What an like asshole. It or not, you're going to have to learn to work together. And you, you need to understand what it means to be a part of the Brotherhood. What? We're not soldiers. Be an asshole? We're an army. And we've dedicated our lives to uphold a strict code of ethics. If you intend to stay within our ranks, you need to obey our tenets without question. Don't worry. I've spent time in the military. Perfect. Then there's no need to give you a long lecture. <laughs> so I'll get right to that. <laughs> Fucking what? I only ask for two things from anyone under my command. Honesty and respect. You fall in line, you stay in line. I give you an order, and you follow it. It's as simple as that. Now, before I release you to Halen and Reese for your assignments, there's one last order of business. From this moment forward, I'm granting you the rank of Initiate. This is cool. only a training rank. I'm not permitted to grant ranks any higher than that. Fair enough. Not permitted. Why can't you promote me beyond Initiate? Only an Elder can promote you beyond Initiate. After we get the transmitter up and running, I'll call in and see what I can do. Fair enough. Fair enough. Outstanding. <laughs> Ad victorium initiate. She doesn't Ad. even know what that means, Halen. Ooh. Ad victorium Ooh. means to victory. Ooh. In our eyes, defeat is unacceptable because we're fighting for the future of mankind. Yeah, well, you all are fucking idiots. More powerful than any weapon you could ever carry. Remember that. 
Now, I need you to report to Halen or Reese for your next assignment. Dismissed, soldier. I guess I'll talk to Halen. <laughs> Was it her? Yeah, Halen sounds less of an asshole than Reese here. Scribe Halen. Reese still giving you the cold shoulder. Who gives a shit? Uh, I give up. <laughs> Seeing eye to eye, who cares? Uh, I can handle it. I can handle it. If you could, you'd be the first. Reese bleeds brotherhood. It's all he cares about. It's oh. his family. Uh, so it's be bleed it's green. If anything else comes into the picture and gets in the way, he shoves it aside. What? Is there something between you two? Yeah, why not? Is there something between the two of you? That's none of your business. Oh, my persuasion attempt failed. My charisma is too low. Sure <laughs> I gotta up my charisma. I'm sure they are sleeping know. together or so, seeing each other and then they broke it off. Now assignment? he's all pissed about it. What's your job? Uh, yes. Ready? Great. Let me explain what I need you to do. One of the Brotherhood's most important duties is the recovery and preservation of technology that was lost when the bombs fell. I have a list of locations that contain artifacts we need you to recover in order to have them cataloged and studied by our scribes. Here, this should cover all the information you'll need to find your first artifact. Yeah, this is Good a terrible luck. recon squad. Be careful. Again, you know, any of this stuff, it just blows my mind. It's like, as to what exactly? So it's a recon squad. You got one knight, and then you've got one clown in some kind of shitty... Uh, you, you figure, isn't this the neuro suit for a suit? So where's his suit? Did he get stuck in a hole somewhere and he had to leave it? I can't imagine somebody would be very happy if he did that. Hi. Hey, right. Reese. Out with it. What's your game? My game? 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 What do you mean? I can usually size people up at a glance, but you... You're different. Well, why? Because I'm fucking I'm intelligence? You're not the military type. You're what? a loner. What do you mean? So I can't figure out why you're sticking around. What do you mean? You got what you wanted, so why don't you What do you mean? <laughs> what the fuck do you mean? It's, oh, yeah, I'm not the military type. My character's supposed to be from the military of the fucking path. What, <laughs> what are you talking about? That's a good question. That's a good I question. Guess, I don't know. Then you need to choose a side. You're either with the Brotherhood... Or you're against, or you're against it. it. Oh... Look, I'm gonna cut you some slack because Dance trusts you. But if you step out of line and put any of my brothers or sisters in danger, I'll make sure you regret it. So, ready for your assignment, hero? What's your problem? <laughs> What's your problem? My problem is I can't figure you out. You come from out of the blue, take down a few ferals, and suddenly you're all buddy buddy with Pallet and Dance. I don't know if you're well, I mean, you know, if you guys or... actually did your job, wore armor, or wore something that isn't like a skin-tight gimp suit, we probably wouldn't have this problem. <laughs> look, look at this shit. You think that's gonna stop a bullet? A knife? You, what do you, what do you think? I mean, come on. Ready. Then listen up. Like it or not, one of our most important duties is to keep the Commonwealth clear of the trash. I'm talking about mutants, ghouls, synths. The abominations the damn eggheads caused when they started playing with their toys. This what? op is simple. I'm gonna send you to a Kill target, people. and you're gonna terminate everything that calls it home. All the details you need are right here. Don't come back until the job's done. Wow. Way to be an asshole. Alright, College Square. Alright, let's, uh, let's get to Diamond City first, and then we can go from there. You have to admit, it's like, well, two two of them have nothing. One guy's supposed to have armor. The girl at least has some kind of pouches. Looks like she could be something useful. He he just looks like he's got jack squat. And again, I think it is the fact that he's supposed to have a suit of power armor. Maybe it's because I'm here so early or what. But you figure, hey guys, uh, you know, you'd actually be smart. Uh, let's see, the Flux Center in the back street. Where the hell is this at? Way the fuck over there. Alright, let's do some violence. Uh, where is it? Oh. Oh, College Square. Okay. So, we'll do that first. Since we're in the suit, I might as well do some violence. Might as well have some unadulterated, unadulterated violence, right? Plus, there should be goodies in here, right? Right? The feral ghoul. Wow. You guys are super powerful now. See, it's not so bad when you've got the laser rifle. Like I said, there should have been no reason as to why any of these guys, any even this recon team, would have trouble with these things. Shouldn't be that hard. 
But I'm sure Hurley Burley and Durley over there are like, well, you know, I kind of sprained my ankle when we were fighting and, well, they came over and they grabbed my chest and I didn't like it. What'd you find, boy? You found nothing. You found nothing. I think I'm going to call you Tin. Eh. Maybe. I don't know. It's like it's split between Tin and Shamu. Hello. You can just you can just lay there. Don't don't even bother getting the fuck up. Just die. Nobody likes you. Oh, there's a gas leak. I guess I could unleash the gas. Kind of feels silly now actually using this because it's like, well, I've got a laser rifle and I shouldn't have to worry about using a suit. But by Job, I wanted to use it to show it off a little bit and feel like I'm not shitting my pants with terror every time I go by somebody. Let's see, there we go. Nice. Nice. All these skeletons, everyone's being foolish. Running this on a fucking toaster. <laughs> I still can't believe there's raiders out here. Oh, there we are. What are you doing? If I can shoot. There we go. Hey, buddy. There we go. And see, this is how you normally would deal with it. Guy in power armor, completely defended. I'm sitting here in rusted up armor, too. It's not even that, uh... That's special. Don't have that many weapons, don't have that much on my own. Already dealing with 99% of the problems here. Just goes to show the Brotherhood aren't as uh, technologically bright as they seem. My kleptomania has only increased the ability to carry more. Oof. Sure that blew up one of the legs, right? No, no, it's still pretty green. Or pretty brown. Oh, shit. I don't know who's putting mines out here. It's a nice spot, though. Dig it into a hole right underneath where you'd step. Very smart move. Let's see, this is a good zone. This would be a good spot to actually have people out on. And I wonder, with the recon team that's out here, granting that there's probably, or supposed to be, more of them. I hear you, dog. Where the fuck are you? Oh, nice. Nice. Oh, thank you. You missed three times. I appreciate it. And I hit multiples. Uh, I was saying, for a recon team that's very small, and I think there's probably five of them, Five for that recon team, with one guy in power armor, the rest just lightly dressed. I think it would have been a better move instead of actually establishing an outpost. Especially when it doesn't it doesn't seem like it does anything. I mean there's no manufacturing, there's no supply depot, there's nothing. It, it just seems like there's Jack Squat. So, I don't know what exactly they would be getting out of this. Oh, nice. See, and again, I could understand raiders being here. You have no other means of supplies and whatnot, and this seems like a very safe place to roll. So, you know, why not? Why not be down here dealing with all this crap? And just keep stealing stuff off these people's bodies. I'm repatriating it. See, power, people, perfection, and I guess it's uh, nuclear fusion or misfusion. Fusion technology, man. It would be the future. It would save a lot of energy. Give people a lot of stuff. There's a toes. You see, what the fuck is going on down here? And somebody's making a speech. And more ghouls. Again. I don't know how most people ended up losing against these guys. Granting, maybe if I started using the pipe gun and stuff. I know the pistols, pistol and the shotgun weren't as effective, but having this, this laser rifle, cleans everything up. And then having like 437 rounds, that's nice. Granting that uh, I did... Hey. Oh, dog, get out of the way. 
Get out of the way, Get Shamu. Cancel. Yeah, it's just yawn. Yo, oh, I actually thought it was somebody else, not just some automated system. I thought it was somebody saying, hey, there's a guy killing people down here. Somebody help. Yeah. There's a robot. We can fire him up. Probably will. Again, I don't know why they do all this stuff. Oh, expert. Oh, it's red. What, is it going to piss somebody off? Who's going to get pissed off? Gonna be the Brotherhood of Steel getting to get God. pissed off? How dare you? How dare you unlock a door? How fucking dare you? Now, I'll probably break the game here doing this shit. Because you don't want to do this in Power Armor. The game doesn't like it when you do this. Especially if you do it multiple times. I wonder if I get on one knee when I do this shit. Because it's like... Uh, let's see. As you can tell, I don't even read these. I just find the words and just clap them. Just clap them. Eventually, I'll succeed. Oh, sweet Jesus. Nope. I'm actually happy they don't take that as a... Oh, God. Oh, do I have to actually start thinking? Do I have to start using my brain power here? Error. Got it. There we go. And so we're using my brain power. It's like. <laughs> yeah, go do your job. Excellent. Oh, Jesus. Live and love. You won't believe who wants went. Probably went. Uh, nuke the man. Deviant Festival is sweeping the nation. Huh? A Deviant Festival, I should say. That's interesting. Live and love. Companions inflict 5% more damage. That's great. I'm sure Dog will need it. I mean, and if we ever get anybody else. Come on, you lazy thing. Let's see what's down here. This is now a combat zone. Oh, nice. You see, the only way these things would survive and thrive is if you actually punched them. Like, you know, they have to punch the Protectron. And you normally, they're not stronger than a human being, predominantly. And you can set that shit on fire if I use this laser. But, uh, well, what the fuck does this, what, what is this supposed to do? Just turn the robot. Can I just get it to where it fires lasers instead of being stupid? Like, why would you engage in hand to hand combat when you could just shoot somebody with a laser? Sweet. Woman was the password? My god. Uh, personality. Uh. I'm gonna put default. Let's see if that fixes it. And stop being stupid. Yeah, I don't know why you're dead. Like, if a nuclear explosion went off, it wouldn't have affected inside of here. So what the fuck happened? They crash? Unidentified intruder detected. And I like the fact that it automatically search. takes on the ghouls rather than fights me. Situation normal. Law and order has been More restored. raiders. So there's a lot of raiders down here. How you die to these things, I don't know. I say that as a man who's probably died of these things and I've forgotten and I'm just talking shit. Because everybody feels superior when they're walking around with power armor, you know? The fuck? Spoon is supposed to come out of that? Let's see what's in this. Oh shit. Hey, you figure I'd be able to force this open if I really, really wanted to. Uh, what else is in here? Anything good? No, just trash. Do I just have a bunch of trash? It cut its arm off. Cut its head off. <laughs> Lasers shooting. Lasers are shooting everywhere. 
Go. Oh, set the defense protocol up. See, they made this super easy. I probably pissed the Protectron off now. Probably shot him. He's probably like, you son of a bitch. Oh no, he died. How tragic. Not really sad. Under. No, that doesn't fall down. This fell down. I don't know why. I'm actually glad. Oh god, ah, <laughs> I've collected too much. Hey. hey dog, come here. You need to stick some more stuff up your ass. No, I'm actually glad you opened your mouth because I could stick it over there too. Take these things. All of this shit. All of it. Take it all. Don't hold the doors. Please, do not hold the doors. It's upsetting to everyone. Alright. There you go, dog. Thank you. Shit. See, this is why you always grab the lock-picking skills. You always grab the stuff that'll get you somewhere. Because you always need it. Always. Because you will never come back here unless you are that obsessed with loot, which... I grant, I am myself to a certain extent. But let me tell you, it gets tedious coming back to these locations. And that's always the issue whenever you have skills like that. It's like, okay, I get it. In some runs that I could do, I could use lockpicking more. But between lockpicking and science, it's always... It's always a tried and true method to try and get more and more. So what the fuck is over here? There's something going on down here. Now what the fuck do I have to do in here? Is there something in here that I need to grab? Did I not murderize everything? I thought I killed everything down here. Hey dog. Go on dog, get your ass out of the way. Yeah. I don't need to talk to him, unfortunately. Go there. Sometimes I hate this. There. Come on, Shamu. There we go. Let's see. Open the door, Billy! Even though I could probably kick the door open with my increased strength. Yes. Hey buddy. Merry Christmas. You're dead. Braxum, some other crap, so... Hey! I got a key. I always do like those keys. I, you know, you don't see enough keys. And I'm sure you could use that. I guess I could have gone around this section. Some other... Let's see. Is there another way in here? There was, wasn't there? Yes, you could have gone this way. Then you wouldn't have even had to have had any kind of black picking skills, because then you could use the key! Let's see, there's nothing else that I see that I need. I really want to get in there to get into that. I don't... Oh, yes, we can get in there. I thought so. I was like, there's got to be a way. If they've put a, put a little thing there, I should be able to get in. can't just leave that there without me being able to take it. You have to admit, everybody's pretty well preserved for 200 years. Could rip that... Yeah, it's the military? Is that what he had? It was a military uniform? What the hell was he doing? What were they doing, I wonder? Sub up. Yeah, that's closed. We don't need that. Get up here, get up here. Don't worry, it'll seem a lot better. I did take and turn off my motion blur because I wanted to see if that helped me in gameplay wise while things are fast. I think it does to a certain extent. Obviously, it doesn't convey the sense of speed that most people are used to. Sweet. There we go. Some caps. 
And I just want to be able to see as I run. Alright, then we gotta go see that other zone. Uh, hopefully we get to fight some super mutants. That'll be fun. Right? It's always fun fighting super mutants. No oh, shit, it's dark. Oh, it's nice and dark out here. Let's see. I don't think we will... I don't think it uses up any energy. We'll see. I'm going to take a go back here, drop off some stuff, and be right back. And I think... Okay, I was going to say, we're going to have some hostiles here. I thought I was like, oh shit, we're going to have to blow the, whatever the fuck that is. It's got the light. It's just Coxworth. Alright, store all the junk. Store all this crap. That'll eventually sell. Don't worry, we'll eventually sell it all. All this crap. Yes, 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 yes. Keeping my wedding ring on because it's just how my character is. Where the fuck are you, Shamu? Shamu! I am definitely going to go with Shamu. You know, <laughs> for all the BS that I have to put up with this dog, I'm calling it Shamu. I'm calling it Shamu. He's, he's barking at something. It's like the real world. Doug's barking always at something, right? Maybe I should just have Coxworth. Yeah. I, I hope to have somebody else. I, I really don't like using Coxworth too much. He's not, uh, not as useful as you'd think he would be. Uh, let's, let's see. What is our objective? Speaking of which, our power cells are still low, but we're probably all right. With the flux sensor. We got that. We cleaned up the commonwealth there. Yeah, we're going to take and go back. We're going to do the back streets. Let's do this. Don't think we'll have ghouls. I think we'll actually fight super mutants now. Successful attacks in advance. Build your critical meter. That's actually pretty cool. And I do like the fact that you can spin this around and it becomes a pin. That is pretty neato. All right. Here we are again. Damn, it's foggy. See, this would be the kind of this would be the time to attack this base. And see, the thing I don't like about this is that there's too many entryways. Also, you can crawl through here. You can hop up on the wall and get over the walls. It'd have been better just to have all of this barred up, boarded up, and then just had a top, and then maybe have a throw down gate. Because you can even get it back. You could hop over this. You could get over in this location over here. Let's see. Yeah, they're almost out of that. See, there was that was sealed up. Yeah, and this is a gate. See, this is this is a good move to have a gate here. It'd have been even better if you had a gate across the whole damn thing, so you actually had to open a door, rather than just being able to walk in and out of this with relative ease. Because you wouldn't think twice about it. You just walk into it, and then what are you gonna do? As a Brotherhood member, what are you gonna do? You got to take and stop ghouls from attacking. It's like, okay, we'll just put a gate there. They they're not smart enough to be able to break down a gate, so. Oh, I would assume they're not. Uh-oh. Yeah, we just used up one of our fusion cores. We're going to try not to use this all too much because we're going to run out. Eternal Post Office. 115, huh? I guess I could open that. You know what? Let's get over here. We'll come back and see some of these locations when we do. And I probably will just hit Diamond City after I get across the bridge. Hit Diamond City as well. And put up the suit for a little bit. Let's see, what is this building? Come on, give me the location, damn it. There we go. Shit's spooky, man. Yeah, there's the Polskis. Is this open? Anybody inside? There's stuff inside. Nothing good in there. Souvenir magnet. You get a souvenir magnet. Congratulations. And there should be two bridges, from what I saw on the map. If they... Yeah, you know, there should be another bridge down the way. Let's see if this one's got any contesting. See, this would be somewhere, if you were trying to hold, clear this bridge off a bit, and you'd be able to take this. You can control who comes in, who goes out. You can charge a toll. 
Mm, Jesus. USS Riptide, huh? Now look, there are raiders up here. This is this, again, this is a great spot. If people are trying to get through here, you can charge tolls for this shit. You can. I don't know he's gonna stop you. I mean, unless there's someone like me who's coming through here and annihilating you, but Oh, they're pulling sharks out of the water and eating it? That's pretty good. Smart move. They don't look like sharks, they look like mutated dolphins, but I think there's something else. Ooh, is that a dog? No, oh, come here. There you go. Damn. The red bandana. It's my dog. Yeah, I, I don't think I would be staying around if I saw a guy shooting lasers and walking in a giant mech suit. I'm just saying. Oh, look at that. Has he got a... No, he's got a suit too. Okay, nice. Pretty smart suit. No, oh, I got a time again. That's pretty smart. Pretty smart move. That's a very smart move. Yeah, nice job. Now yeah, take the top of that. He's an older man. Makes sense. I mean, shit. If I if I had that kind of suit, hell yeah, I'd take somebody on. But uh, again. Fully armored suit versus what you got. It's like, I don't know, man. It's even got military equipment over here. That's something. Somebody's whipping grenades. I hear them, and I've seen them. They're shooting at me. Where the fuck are they? They're from the top. I know that. Where are they? Yeah, you're whipping grenades, I see. In a suit, so it's not as dangerous. And I'm happy that I actually took the suit, because now I realize that, yes, I probably did need this. And for some reason, I'm burning. I, I don't know why. Where the fuck? Where? Did she die? She... Oh, there you are. Oh. Bitch. I know, you don't want to jump in the water with your suit. You'll, you'll drop to the bottom. You drop to the bottom and you lose it. And that's not fun. But yeah, that was a pretty smart move of theirs. To have a little boat set up. Charge a toll. And it would have been better to say, hey, uh, you know, pay a toll. Or have a little booth that says, hey, pay toll here. And we won't end your life. And it would help. Otherwise, they're not, uh, not thinking of money-making solutions, you know? And, hey, if it was fair enough, I don't think anybody would really complain. Maybe, depending on, how, I guess, how much traffic there is, maybe 100 caps. 200, 300 maybe? Or do it per... Oh... I don't even know if you could say per ton. It's probably per... I, I'm thinking tons because I'm thinking of railroad stuff right now. But, uh, yeah, doing tonnage and stuff would be hilarious. It's like, yeah, try and put a huge ton on a... Like, one ton on those damn... Oh... On anything that is an animal. I can't remember. It's a Brahmin. There you are. Hey, you did. The sound lagged out. You gotta be joking. Yes, I am joking. The fuck is shooting at me? I hear it, and I see the bullets flying across. That's a smart move. That is a very smart move to do that. Very, very smart move to do that. Oh, look, another turret inside of a. Yeah. Let's see. I just beat it to death. You know, I'll just leave it. Just in case, say, a super mutant or something happened. Let's see, what is that trinity? Help or mayday or whatever it is one says on a radio. My name... Well, okay, well, it's this direction. Or mayday or whatever it is one says on a radio. My name is Rex Goodman. I'm being held prisoner on the top of Trinity Tower. I think the super mutants plan on eating me soon. I'm setting this to repeat. Ah, oh, shit! Gotta sign off. One of the super mutants is coming! Help! Or... Mayday or... Interesting. Okay. Well, let's go save him. This fucking fog. This is, this again, this is a good time if you were a raider, if you're a super mutant, or even myself, this would be a good time to actually attack fortified locations, because normally... On pristine days, they obviously have sight. On non-pristine days, they have uh, 
like this, you have a little bit of an issue on your defense. It also puts people on edge. Especially if you have something to defend. What the fuck is that noise? So you guys aren't you guys aren't bad. You guys aren't gonna be what I worry about. I can fucking aim. There we go. Yes, dog found something. I think he found a evil. There you go. Take his eight ball. Take the eight ball out of his ass. All right, and we got red on our knees. Let's see. Have we lost him yet? Not yet. Okay. Once we lose those, we're probably gonna have a troubling time. Gonna a hell of a time to try and get him back. There's always the thing about these suits. You can fix them with steel. You need plenty of steel. And I see spikes over here, so this is a fortified location. I'm trying to be stealthy in a, a uh, suit of power armor. There's Trinity Plaza. You're here. Yeah, this would be a good spot to hold out if you're trying to hold out against uh, hostiles. Don't see anybody, though. Hey, there's somebody. Hey, you. Drop over. Dead and dead. Yeah, it looks like your scout... Well, I should say your sentries. Yeah, fucking nasty. Yeah. Uh, you know, I don't like the fact that they turned them into cannibals, but this is something that happened in the third game, so it shouldn't surprise anybody. This is the East Coast Super Mutants. Not the very bright ones, as you can tell. Oh, this thing runs like ash. Human job. Shouldn't have pulled that out. Okay, so he's not that far on Trinity Tower. Seems like it's pretty... This isn't so bad. I'm picking up a bunch of garbage, so I should watch it. I should watch what I pick up. Yeah, like mole rat teeth. You don't need any of that shit. It's not like you're crushing it up and using it as carbon or something like that. Oh, God. Come around the corner. Get out of the way, Shamu. This isn't as bad as I thought it would be. I thought this was going to be worse. Now, I suppose I don't have a jetpack, so I can't do anything. Can't crawl across that. All right, well, fine. Fuck. Do I have to take, uh... I could have, like I said, I could have sworn, last time I went through this, this was a lot harder than, uh... What I've done thus far. I thought there was going to be more super mutants, but I guess not. Maybe since I'm hitting it again at such a low level, they've cut down on the units? I don't know. The amount of super mutants... That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, here's your... You know, it's funny, is they made these the science fiction orcs. Yeah, okay. There you are. You're dead. Congratulations, you are dead. You suck. Look at those things. Look how ugly they are. Hey, buddy. Yeah, you got a, you got some armor on you. Doesn't really do too much against laser technology, but, you know. I guess I can't sit down and say much about it. My nuclear physicist, I'll have to do that at 14. Robotics, not a big deal. Chems could be better. Let's see, how long do these... See, the thing is, I don't, I'm don't. i not taking a lot of chems yet. I'll probably use that later. We probably will definitely use that later, I should say. Uh, none. I could probably get that for a rifle. Uh, you know what? Screw it. I'm going to take this. Because again, get that. I need to get this as well. 
Because ammunition, you're always going to need more. Let's see, five hundred caps. And then I know we can... I think one of these... Yeah, see? We need a, at least six charisma. Because we need supply lines so I can actually... Like, wherever I take and scrap stuff, I can always have it in all of them. So I can move all that stuff without having to pick it up and take it. Bad man, don't hit my dog. Again, if you hit a dog and you're trying to get it off of you, hitting it isn't really going to help. It's just going to dig the teeth in. It's just going to dig the teeth in more. You have to break the jaw or cut the muscles where the, you know, where they keep it compressed. Because, you know, that's always the danger of dogs, is the fact that you have a dog, they're trained to run, jump, grab, and then pull. Normally, they're to slow people down, or take it as a non-lethal option. Just depends on how they're trained. And apparently, our dog has been trained to attack people, so... Shut up! They got mutant hounds themselves, and it's too busy howling. You fight almost as good as a super mutant. Maybe we will put you in a cage with strong and rats. Yeah, I don't know about that. I, I, I really don't care. You guys aren't that tough. The thing is, I still have it on the same difficulty I've had it on before. It's just I have armor, and I've got... Uh, I just got a, the, the correct kind of weapon. I mean, once you get laser technology, most of this stuff is pretty easy. I know I was getting my ass handed to me before, and it's just because you didn't have anything that's really effective. Once you get stuff that is effective, shit's the cakewalk. And even more so when you take and get these suits, when we get a super... Yeah, I'm scared. I'm scared, baby. I'm scared of you. I'm very, very scared. I'm so scared, I'm shaking in my metallic boots. You, uh, waste my time. Yes. He's forgotten where we we're at. He's, I think he's below us in one of the rooms. He, oh, there he is. Never mind. Yeah, this is your typical orc reaction. Get angry, shoot, die. Typical orcs. I need to get that for our next buddy. I don't think when we show up with the super mutant that they're going to be happy. We'll see, though. It'd be funny if they attack me. I'd be like, well. Let's see. Is there anything out here? Molotovs. Sack of cigarettes. Yeah, buddy. Break into the safe. Oh, shit. Shit. Alright, so it is to the left. Shit. Yes. There we go. Gamma rounds? Hmm. You know gamma rounds are going to be good when you start hearing gamma and plasma. It's all the same. It's going to be some good stuff. Yeah, you guys aren't scary. Yes, and you're dead. You see, it's smart to have that armor. It's smart to have armor. I mean, it would be very effective against... Like, what they're doing, where they have a base of operations where you have to go from up, from down to up, they have more people on the ground floor, you probably have an easier time. So it's, I can't I can't fault them for their strategy of hiding out in a building. It's not a bad idea. It just isn't as effective as they think it would be. You know? Alright, let's go up. Go, oh, Shamu. And again, I think this was a little bit harder when I didn't have laser technology. But, who knows, maybe when I get up here I'll get my ass handed to me. We'll see.